What up fam? What up family? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Bizmatic and I'm back with another review for y'all. This time around, this time around we got Molly Hatchet with Fall of the Peacemakers, all right? Now, if y'all want to see more of Molly Hatchet on this channel, y'all let me know what's next in the comment section below. And of course, y'all know me. I got the Schlerks. Let's go ahead and listen. <laughs>
Wow. Molly, <clears throat> Molly Hatchet is just, they, oh, man. They, they, they are just ridiculous. Like, I, I don't know how else to describe them. Like, they are just ridiculous. As far as, as a, a southern band, not even a southern band, just a band in general. They're just ridiculous, man. The instrumentation work, as you just heard on the second half of the song, the instrumentation work is, is, is freaking crazy. Crazy guitar work. And they got a dope vocalist, but... As far as the lyrics on this song, this is uh, this came out what 1983, and I feel like it sounds more like a 70s song. You feel me? Um, and when we talk about like like fall of the peacemakers, right? The people who who move people, right? The people who saying something that's gonna make you go out there and do something and make you want to change, whatever. People call it the system, whatever you want. Those people always end up end up dying. Actually, the person who sent me this to review it and said it was kind of like you know a little a little nod to to MLK and, and you know other people that that you know that try to make a a, a crazy change and then you know, poof. and it, it's it's crazy when you think about it. Like I can't I can't speak about no um other other cultures but i know like as far as like like black cultures and what we call the so-called black leader uh the good ones always die <laughs> like the good ones the fbi is on their ass like the good ones die like if a dude if you see a dude come up and he's speaking and he's getting and the key the key that's what people don't understand right because people say well i see on youtube right there's people that spread conspiracies and stuff and people be like well why ain't that person dead right i'm a big consp conspiracy theorist by the way uh, big is a, is a is a big word <laughs> i'm up to a certain degree all right uh i use a lot of common sense also but look I feel like the key word is move people, right? You could say whatever you want. You could be telling the most truth, right? If you're not getting people to move and actually change, then it don't even matter. Like, who cares, right? I could tell you, I could tell you, look, if you eat like four bananas a day and, 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 and one of those bananas, you got to split it up and put like some Skittles inside. That's the remedy to, to, to being a millionaire, right? Four bananas a day, one of those bananas, you got to split it up and blah, 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 right? If a thousand people hear that message and out of a thousand, one of them do it, it don't even matter. Like, this shit don't matter, like... I mean, it matters to that person. He changed someone's life, but you actually not moving people. Now, if out of like a thousand people, like seven or eight hundred, or even let's say fifty percent of fifty, fifty, um, I said a thousand, five hundred people do it. Now you're moving people. Now it's like, all right, I gotta watch him. Like he, he's getting people up and doing shit. So. That, that, that's, that's what you notice with all of our leaders. All of our leaders, they had people in the streets, like, making changes. And, you know, though, and, and those people got to go. Got to go. It's too much. We don't want to deal with that. And I'm pretty sure it's like that for, for uh, many cultures. I can only speak about what I know. But, like, I'm pretty sure it's like that for, for many cultures. Like, let's say, actually, um... <clears throat> We could we could even talk about Kennedy, right? We could talk about the impact that um, Kennedy was having and what type of person he was. Yeah, he was getting some pussy on the side. <laughs> you, know, you gotta get some pussy on the side. Uh, but I mean, the the stuff he was saying was like, huh? You feel me? Um, Cause he wasn't for no fuckery, uh, and you know. And I know, I, 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 and there's another president that's like that, but y'all hate him, so I ain't, we ain't gonna talk about that. Uh, and really, I'm not really into political stuff, but as far as this song, this song makes so much sense because it's talking about, like, it's not even just about that. It's not even just about, like, peacemakers, uh, leaders, and stuff like that. It's more about, like, like the, the how, how about the average peacemaker, right? You feel me? How, how about the, the, the normal person that's living their lives and, and, and their store get robbed and they got to try to fight back and they get shot? Like, it's just so much corruption and human on, on human hate that's going on right now. It's ridiculous, man. Uh, some neighborhoods, people don't even walk out like that. Like, you feel me? It got to be 
broad daylight, you feel me? Uh, some of these kids in Chicago, they don't walk outside unless their camera phone is on so they could, like, record shit and make sure, like, they could get to the fucking corner store safe. It's crazy. Um, I don't know. Maybe peace will come. Maybe not. And, and not only that, bro, they got us going against each other with everything. They got us going each other uh, every single way that's possible, right? Skin color, weight, gender. Uh, you feel me? Talking about, oh, fat phobic. No, you shouldn't be fat. Uh, skin color. Um, um, people talk about white supremacy or black people are, are, are just degenerates or whatever the fuck they be saying, right? Uh, uh, different races and ethnicities right uh shit muslim people are gonna blow us up uh white people run the world shit like that like they got us go every single class right fuck the rich people they don't care what the poor the poor are lazy uh the middle class it, 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 you feel me yo they got us so fucked up and mingled up like we're going against each other in every single way that is possible. <laughs> we are against each other in every single way that's possible. Old people versus young people. Oh, these old people, they don't want to let go and let's run shit. Old people. Yo, these young people, they don't know shit. Why would we let you run some shit when you don't know shit? So how, how the fuck do you get out of that? <laughs> I think women versus men. <laughs> men ain't shit. Women ain't shit. Like, you feel me? Gays versus straight. Like, what the hell? It, it, it's it, even, <clears throat> even women got to go against men that have become women too. Like, everybody's against each other. So, um... You know, maybe one day we'll have the rise of the peacemaker. Anyways, if you made it this far, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. Let me know how you feel about the song. And um, let me know what's next for Molly Hatchet. Uh, like it. Share it with somebody that's dope. I'll see y'all in the next one. And guess what? You better be there.